I am presenting my new project, Weekly AI and Video Creation News. Tonight, The Great Divide. Like and comment if this idea makes the difference. Dr. Elena Carubba here. Tonight, the week the world leaned further into AI's promise and into its hardest questions. Chip deals, regulation fights, new models that see, hear and produce at a scale we barely understand. We'll explain what it means for you, your work and your future. Stay, this is the one you'll forward. Top five this week. A major infrastructure play reconfigures compute supply chains. Billions are flowing to support the next generation of foundation models. New model releases sharpen the debate about deep fakes, privacy and truth. Europe's AI law moves from theory to enforcement. Compliance, audits and fines are becoming real levers. Scandal. Workday is being sued over its AI-powered hiring tool, which plaintiffs say unfairly rejects older, disabled and black applicants. The AI apparently filters out resumes in minutes, raising concerns of systemic age and race discrimination. Aweek.com A surprising corporate pivot. Legacy investors reshuffle AI stakes. That market signal matters for every creator planning long term. Viral creativity. Three short social clips you must see this week. We'll run them in our roundup. If you want the best of AI news made practical and viral, like subscribe and share now. We publish every Thursday night. Headline deep dive compute and capital. First, compute is the currency of this decade. This week's market moves are not minor. They rewrite who can scale and who can't. Major investments into compute partnerships mean that a few large organisations will control the fastest experimental cycles for frontier models. That's both opportunity and power concentration. From our power matrix perspective, AIQ is the raw capability. More compute means faster models, more AIQ. SSQ is the distribution question. Who gets access and who bears the externalities? EEQ is the human cost. Are workers, creators and users protected when models scale? Action for creators tonight. Audit where your content is hosted, what AI tool chain you use and build redundancy. If your business depends on one cloud or one model API, you're exposed when compute markets shift. Make one contingency plan this week. Mirror content and plan a migration path. Model release new multimodal. Next, the newest multimodal model release this week pushes vision, sound and text together in one engine. This is not incremental. It feels like a different class of tool. It can summarise long video, answer questions grounded in images and propose edits all in a single pass. The creative possibilities are huge, so are the harms. As Toni Morrison wrote, language matters. Multimodal models rewrite the rules of language by attaching sight and sound to our words. The result, deeper storytelling power and greater responsibility. Creators demand provenance. When you use multimodal outputs, annotate what was generated, what was human crafted, and supply a simple one-line provenance card with every public asset. Regulation and trust. Regulation matured this week into enforcement. That means audits, documentation requirements and penalties for mislabeled AI outputs. For institutions and universities, the ask is practical. You must show the chain of custody for model training data, explain automated decisions and provide redress routes for affected people. Three compliance steps for teams. One, log your prompts and data sets. Two, build an appeals process for users. Three, create a two-tier review for public-facing AI outputs. Start with a single policy page and publish it. Transparency is the new currency. Persona of the week. This week's persona, a leader who bridges rigorous research and humane design. They're public work champions, responsible tech that serves people, not replaces them. They call for human-centred guardrails and have founded programmes that place ethics at the heart of engineering. For our audience, academics, creators and leaders, this figure embodies the triad. 
AIQ, Technical Excellence, EEQ, Ethical Intelligence, SSQ, Social Judgment. We'll link their key talk and three practical takeaways in the show notes. Watch it for strategy, not just inspiration. Subscribe and like if you like this idea of weekly news. A fan shared how AI helped design a prosthetic learning tool for her son, built from student recordings and a small private data set. It took an idea and narrowed the path to impact in weeks, not years. That's the bright side. When AI is governed well, it accelerates human flourishing. If you have an AI success story, tangible, humane and replicable, send it to us. We'll feature it next week. Add it in the comment or contact me in the comment. Weird story of the week. An AI generated a viral experimental taste test for music, composing insect-inspired micro-operas that fans insisted sounded like a childhood memory. It's delightful and eerie. When machines hit uncanny cultural notes, audiences anthropomorphize instantly. Not all viral is valuable, but it teaches us what hooks human attention. Top social clips, YouTube, TikTok, Instagram. Curated viral watch list, three picks per platform that teach, entertain or shock and why they matter to creators. YouTube top three instructive and long form lessons. A 12 minute explainer that used a multimodal model to annotate historical footage. Brilliant use of grounded AI for public history. A creator's week-long documentary on building an AI side product, Transparent Failures Made It Human. An academic lecture turned into a vivid explainer using AI-generated visual metaphors, shows how scholarship becomes viral when visualised. TikTok Top 3. Micro-tutorial on prompting for vibe editing. A comedic AI deepfake remix done ethically creator labelled model use, shows boundaries and virality. A one-take AI tool stack demo, fast, honest and practical. Instagram Reels Top 3, a creator's before-after using an AI edit workflow. A silent montage turned emotional by AI sound design, lessons on mood. A short captioned explainer on AI provenance, a model for institutional reuse. The Great Divide, now the big theme, AI utopia or human reckoning. This is not a morality play, it's structural. If machines optimise away our mistakes, what remains human? If AI reduces suffering, does it also reduce the messy adversarial growth that births art, ethics and responsibility? An answer emerges from three quadrants. AIQ builds capability. EEQ asks how we steward emotion and moral life. SSQ demands distributional fairness. The solution isn't less AI, it's wise AI matched with rigorous governance, public literacy and institutional design. Design principle for leaders, any AI deployment must pass three tests. One, does it increase agency? Two, does it preserve relational dignity? Three, is it reversible? If the answer is no to any, pause. Tactical playbook. Three immediate plays you can do tonight. Provenance badge. Add a one-line provenance note to every AI-assisted asset. Template in the show notes. Prompt ledger. Begin a shared prompt log for your team so you can audit outputs. Five entries a week is enough. Audience experiments. Split test one video with AI assist versus human only. Measure watch time, comments and trust signals. Viral craft. How we'll use this. Use the viral playbook we published, strong hook in five seconds, emotional algebra, hit feelings then cognition, and AI as a creativity multiplier, never a substitute for lived authenticity. Three CTAs you must use in every episode. One, like, two, subscribe. Three, share. Say them in different ways at three points in the show. This engages the algorithm and human networks. We are in the middle of a collective experiment. This show will be your weekly field notes in the experiment. Next week, an exclusive deep dive into transparency tools for creators. We've tested them. Bring your questions. We'll answer live. If this episode sparked a strategy for you, 
Try one of the three plays tonight and tell us what happens. My team will curate the best stories and we'll feature you next week. Subscribe, share and, most importantly, think critically. Good night.